Oh, okay, more flowers grow. That makes sense. Good morning, welcome to Sunday for another day, and for new for the profit of your own company. The paper is seen to sail and be asleep, it's like around you, but it needs a creature. No wonder they ask for the skills. I'm beneath the onion and press A to call them out. Make that screen a bit more complex, but generally it's the same stuff. What the hell are you doing, new? Sounds like curry too, actually. Oh, that's easy enough. That didn't have a Pikmin 3. Let's knock that thing down right away. We've got our day timer. We're back again. I guess the point of this little area is to find flowers. Oh, not up there yet. Perfect. Maybe it sounds like Kirby. Oh, you're on the way, dude. So we got just over enough. Uh, why don't you stray off path, little dick dick? You're lucky. <laughs> You're lucky I didn't need ya! <laughs> so I guess enemies drop their own little spoils too. Hinting that some are gonna have treasures. Classic little bastards. Okay, so when you were getting this already. Maybe not. Things feel so much heavier in this game. Come on, buddies, help out. That'd be a little Pick Pick Brothers. Reminds me of Star Fox Adventures at the Pick Pick Berries or whatever they're called. Help your bros and hoes out. You know you can't really tell genders in Pikmin. Well, the pink ones look like girls, and the white ones also, the white ones kind of look like goth girls, even though they're white. <laughs> well! Abundance of this population now. Really need all the Pikmin we can. I 
All you bastards get on this. That's not what I mean. I said get on this shit. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You gonna help? No, only, only that much will do. So, I'm gonna guess they can break this down and there's nowhere else to go. I like those little sand walls Pikmin 3. Yep, they're, they're good on that. Always good to have Pikmin multitask and such. <laughs> I love their little formation. <laughs> Look like a big flower that's carrying something. Big flower, a gigantic flower platform with no stem. It's so cute. It's so adorable. Like little they're like little baby flower petals. A really exotic flower. That is scary when it's holding a can. Kinda of gonna swallow it, but no, just bring it to its mothership. Utter scrap. <laughs> That's what it is. Utter scrap. I can't definitely hold down the whistle button. Alright, time for you to help your new chachos out. Since they can't tell your genders, referring to you as new chacho. Which is neither man nor woman. Go on, go on. Get in there, little new chachos. Go! Oh. And sucking mechanics making you through the opposite way. I'm gonna like the mini game. I'm pretty sure this game has this mini game. I'm gonna like it. Vuck. 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 Oh, there we go. How can I pick Mandish Joy such a massive wall? Not that big. When Master Mike is ferocious. Louis, did Alamar instruct you on from a pigment commanding protocol? Apparently not. Alamar, you are failing in your duty as a superior. Allow me to explain. Press A to grab Pikmin and release to throw them. Call them into a group with B. Press C to expand the group. Point at the screen and press down on cross to issue orders. Press down on cross the swarm Pikmin on treasure to enemies or make them march in a line. Ah, oh, okay, that's um, that sounds like something. Oh. It's like a hot spring or something. The hell is this? Interesting. Warm air is running up from this from the hole in the ground before you. What could lie on the ground? What is wrong? You both show expressions of unease. Do not fear. The leaders group of Pikmin will join you. I shall dispatch my research pod too. Approach the hole, press A to jump in. Oh, so it's not a hot spring. Show this hole with your Pikmin squad? Hell yes. I don't know what this is about. Oh, this is interesting. Emergence cave. <coughs> this is interesting. Intriguing. My heat sensors indicate that this hull's carrier is warmer than on the surface. And I also suggest danger lies ahead, but the promise of treasure is tantalizing. If you wish to check on the ground terrain, press plus to communicate with me. I am not just a ship, I am an all-purpose support pod. Good for you, rareware thingy. Oh, so our date, so our timer thing is stopped. Look, it's fruit!
Let's let the exit of that go down further. Oh, it just feels too short. Citrus lump. Yeah, that was in the Pikmin 3. So we have our first casualty. Sounds like a Pikmin died. Or do we kill him right away? I guess Pikmin 3 is... Probably Pikmin 3 is better with the fact that they gotta stop your game and announce what kind of treasure they get instead of waiting until you beat till the day ends, then they'll tell you and stuff. Because when it brings to the shit, they just announced that the new fruit was collected. They don't, like, stop your game. It only solves the game if it's something important like, you know, a quest collectible. Like, those little phones. I mean, like this. Seven up! Quench quenching emblem. <laughs> That's right. I reference the seven up in this game. So, can they, uh, put these things in here, too? You said you're an all-purpose all pod. <laughs> How can you possibly consider this piece of treasure? Beasts are incompatible with my secretary. I suppose I will store your funds in my hold. But I do not think beasts will be worth my... <laughs> Well, how many of you see on your planet? He yeah, added. So, yeah, you can't sprout more Pikmin all purpose pod. Only. You're no match for Pikmin technology. And the best kind of technology is foreign from organic material. You are. Wait, you are worth treasure? Oh, you're just gonna, like, hold it till I get, till we get back to the onion or something. This hole appears to be quite deep. My senses indicate more treacherous terrain ahead. Maybe if you do recall that you can adjust the camera with Z and up, left, and right on cross, correct? Your expression suggests you do. Excellent. Don't worry, all your pigment will follow you. Approach the hole and press A to enter it. Let's give you a choice in case you accidentally push it. Whee! What will I say these? Emergence Cave 2. This whole thing feels like a nice touch. I hope these will be a bit better. Yeah, huh, they got announced this final floor too. Love how the timer pretty much stops when you're in in these. Is this only this is only for this one because the tutorial or what? Oh, oh, a globe! Oh, that's a, that's some kind of treasure. Hey, it's uh, United, it's North America. It's inconceivable that such an immense object has been buried here for so long. Got that right? The design on the outer shell it resembles the surface of the planet as seen from space. Well then. Perhaps this can be used for something other than salivate. But shall we ever lift it? I fear that even a hundred red Pikmin will be unable to lift it. So I guess when you look for these kinds of things to access other war other well countries, I guess. <laughs> Not he a hundred Pikmin can't lift it. A hundred and one, however, oh ho ho ho. Hey, it's a globe. It's, um, so Pikmin World is, um, our world. It's North America. <laughs> it's funny. Yep. Oh, 
I was clearly making money. So I guess maybe, maybe these enemies are collectibles or something, and they could also become Pikmin for one time. Oh, let's see how this whole cave thing works out. Split and get your stuff. How are you stop there, Lily? Oh, I wonder if this is. Oh, that take us back to the start, uh, to the surface, looks like it. <laughs> Astounding, the traveler believes the cave deep beneath the snowy landscape. Clearly it is warmer down here than above. Look, these pigmen are the restless. They look as if they yearn to be tossed into the flower. Well, I guess that's how I get back up. See that little sunshine. Again, that looks like they can sprout us up too. What the hell is this? Oh, it was a tutorial! Astounding! Water is shooting out of the sky with incredible force. Sensors indicate it has enough power to launch you into the air. Approach it and press A to try. Okay, so what do the flowers do? They look like those morphing flowers from Pikmin 3. Is that... Okay, these might actually turn the Pikmin purple. Huh? Let's just experiment. Yep, purple Pikmin! Sumos! Boom! Those are heavy little bastards. Amazing. A purple Pikmin. It has hair and is quite sucking. It seems very heavy and strong. This kind of Pikmin was not mentioned in your report, Alaba. It must be an entirely new type. Yep. Well, in this game, anyway. Transforming Pikmin by tossing them into flowers. Intriguing. Perhaps there are others. Yep. I guess it would hurt to get a few more. Oopsie. Uh, how do I... How do I switch? I don't want to sacrifice too many red Pikmin, so... Oh, hey! So the purple Pikmin are actually as strong as ten regular Pikmin, so that means we should be able to get this globe in. Well, we may need it. Well, it's the mix of our... Uh, well, five or six purples. And all our other red Pikmin, so, you know. How do I change. How do I, like, change Pikmin? All right, now the rest of you. Go get it! Yeah! And that is the superior strength. I don't know why I can't call you back by touching you, but whatever. Q 
Come on! Lift! Lift! Come on, you're almost there! Come on, so slow! Good thing we're not timed down here! Come on! Dun, dun, dun. A spherical atlas. That is pretty accurate. Let's look at our holy. Oh, we only got the upper atmosphere. We don't have the lower atmosphere. Can't fill in the whole map. There's North America. There's uh, Asia. And there's North Pole. It's not very much North. The very top of the world is pretty barren except for ocean. <laughs> there is a device resembling a microchip embedded inside the sphere. Retrieving data. Bearer. I can only decode a portion of the data, but I did retrieve new geographic charts. I will put this data into my planetary database and name it the Sphere Chart. Press plus to conduct me and go to the exploration kit on the radar screen by pressing left on cross. Now that we have this new data, you should explore the decoded territory tomorrow. How do you guys get over there? Need to learn how to switch Pikmin. How do I switch Pikmin? Oh, that's the wrong button. That's how I can pick pick out the certain group I want, but that ain't gonna help. I want to. That's a crappy ass camera controls. Get over here, dude. Yeah, Pikmin 3 made this whole thing a lot better. I think one of my problems with Pikmin 1, I couldn't figure out how to pick which Pikmin I wanted. And I think, it seems like that problem is the rest of this game. That's how they made Pikmin 3 better. So now we're in the valley repose, repose again. They are successfully returned to the planet's surface. Excellent decision making, gentlemen. We must celebrate your first successful spelunking expedition. You've gathered a large amount of data that needs in-depth analysis. I shall send a report back to the president tonight detailing your progress. And... Alamar and Louis, since you will explore a new area tomorrow, today's work is done. What? You still want to work? Unacceptable. You may not realize it, but you are exhausted. Fuck off. You should take a much needed rest, as you have all the time you need to collect treasure. Haste makes waves, so take it slow and steady. So, is like completing a cave automatically end a day, or is it, or are we just not getting time yet because we're still learning? It's kind of how Pikmin 3 was, but I feel like this is going on longer. In that case, we better be careful of these caves, assuming that's, well, <laughs> it better not be how it is. Oh well.
There's a water area, so I guess we'll just come back here later when we gotta when we begin backtracking. We'll begin backtracking since as as we get the last kind of Pikmin. But so I'm assuming the last kind is gonna be water Pikmin, because water Pikmin is always the last kind. So did anyone anyone die yet? <laughs> I gotta say this map feels a little pretty. Well, guess we're going to the Awakening Wood. <laughs> Later.